What's up, YouTube fam? How's everybody doing? Hope that you're having a wonderful day. It's your girl, Makeup and Marriage, a.k.a. Cooking with Makeup and Marriage. And I'm coming to you today with some dinner. <laughs> uh, we're going to be having uh, something super, super simple. We're going to be having some hot dogs, and I, feel, and I figured why not bring you along with me. So we're going to eat. We've already blessed uh, our food. The guys are eating. So... With some simple buns. We're having hot dogs and chips. This is like a relish that I make. It's um, chopped jalapeno peppers, uh, dill pickles, um, dill relish, um, onions, and mustard. It is so, 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 so yummy. Pass me the chips. It's the simple stuff that be so, so good. I'm gonna bring it in so you can see. There we go. So you can see. So I hope everybody has had a wonderful day. <clears throat> if you had to work today, I hope you didn't work too hard. I had to work and I didn't work too hard. How was your day, Papa? Good. It's good. We've been mm -hmm. off for what? A week. Because mm -hmm. we were already off on weekends, so we were off a full week. Because we was in Florida for eight days. Mm -hmm. In Florida for eight days. Uh and we were off the whole week of last week. <clears throat> and I know in the video I said that my uncle had passed. Wednesday, I wasn't talking about last Wednesday, but the Wednesday before. Just wanted to clear that out. So did you guys like the Super Bowl? How was it for you? It just seemed off to me. The entire Super Bowl just seemed kind of off. Like it had a different vibe to it. I don't know. That was me. And then I fell asleep on it. Did you watch it, baby? Mm -hmm. My husband watched it. How was it? Mm -hmm. He said it was good. So I'm not going to be long, guys. Mm -hmm. Oh, so, okay. That wasn't an easy win then. Mm -hmm. It was the lowest score in history. Super Bowl history. So they was up against a good team. I guess they're all good, but. Mm. So good. Mm. If you've never tried this, mm -hmm. you should give it a try. Just something I came up with. <clears throat> when we moved here to um, Illinois, I said Chicago. They call it Chicago. But when we moved here to uh, Chicago, um, the Chicago Dogs, this is like a kind of variation of it. <clears throat> um, they don't put 
ketchup on hot dogs. And I'm not a hot dog eater. And so when I had it with all how it comes, it was so amazing. I was like, oh my God, because it doesn't taste like a hot dog. It tastes like a really good sandwich, and I liked that. And so since then, that's what I get, the beef hot dogs. And I came up with this little relish. It's mustard, uh, onions. I chop up some onions. I use uh, chopped jalapeno peppers and dill relish. And I mix it up, and it's really good. Um, it's got a little kick to it. It's really good. I remember when I first made it, and my husband's like, you can put that on your sandwich? Because we actually have the stuff to make the Chicago hot dog. And I was like, yeah, I'm trying something. You know, something came to my heart. I'm trying it. So good. And he did something else to his. Oh, and he complained, complained, complained. I was, and I was just like, oh, my goodness, it's so good. Oh, it's so good. I was like, you really should taste them. And he's liked it since. Do you put mayonnaise on your hot dog? Because oh. you can put mayonnaise like on the bun. Bam. Mm. What's wrong? Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. You got ketchup on there? So good. And I'm drinking ginger ale. So the ice is melting in the lake. So it's warmed up pretty good here. Today it was 47 degrees. And now it's like 40 degrees. But it's pretty cool now. Well, it was nice earlier. <clears throat> it was really nice earlier. The snow is almost melted. Uh, our lake is thawing out. Yeah. Sure. Me neither. I don't think it's Hebrew National. Yeah. Okay, that's right. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> well, this time, excuse me, I got the ballpark beef hot dog. I just did that because, like, I wanted my hot dogs to swell, but they didn't swell. I wanted a more plump hot dog. They didn't do it. I wanted to do just pork and chicken hot dog with them. We don't know. Do you know? If you do, drop it down in the comment section.
So do any of you guys like to watch news? We are news watchers. We love watching the news. Actually, I can watch news all day. <clears throat> In between my favorite local news channels. And occasionally we watch uh, Fox News. really good. Doesn't that look good? And if it doesn't, it is good. I think it looks good and it is good. Mm, 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 mm. Just wanted to have something simple. I'm tired. Not from work, but just from being gone all, being gone all of these days. And, trying to recoup and even though flying is the fastest way to travel it is exhausting <clears throat> because I thought about it it takes us almost two hours to get to the airport when you're in Florida and where we where our family is it's almost two hours away from the airport <clears throat> and then the wait to get on the plane and then to get home we have to take a uber or a lift we take a lift to come home and so that's almost right at six hours granted the trip is cut down 12 hours. <laughs> cut down by 12 hours because it take a almost 19 hours to get uh, from Florida to here, from here to Florida. But that's a lot of hustling, hustling, bustling, and getting to and fro. And when we leave here to go to the airport, we're like 50 minutes away. So we're like an hour away. Then we get on the plane, and then we go to Florida, and then we're like two hours away. So, and then just the ride of the plane itself is exhausting. <clears throat> uh, even with it being two and a half hours, uh, you still feel the effects of the jet lag. Make you tired. A little woozy.
I'm wilding now, you know. Yeah, I think I'm done. <clears throat> I thank you guys so much for coming into my home today. I enjoyed you. We had a quick, simple dinner. It was yummy. No fuss, no muss. Uh, didn't have to slow, slave over the oven, <laughs> over the stove. Just put the hot dogs on, let them cook, make a bit of relish or whatever. Or whatever your fixings are. Whatever you like on your hot dogs. Whether it's relish, tomatoes, onions, pickles. I love all of those things uh, since I've been introduced to it on my hot dogs. But something quick and simple. Quick and easy and super simple. <clears throat> And you can go about uh, the rest of your evening. I have some uh, laundry that I need to put up. I have bags that I have unpacked. And I got to put the unpacked stuff where it goes. And I'm already tired. So I had to do something to make things a little easy for me today. So I just thank you guys. I thank uh, everyone. To my new subscribers, hey! Thank you for joining the family. I'm so glad that you're here. I hope you stay to all of my day ones. Hey, y'all. Thank you so much. If you are not a subscriber, but you keep clicking on here, must be something that you like. Go ahead and click that subscribe button. Join the family. I would love to have you. We would love to have you. Come and be a part of my family. I'm sure, I'm sure you'll love it when you... <clears throat> come aboard the family. Please like, share, and comment this video with everybody you know. Tell your mama, your cousin, your sister, your brother, your auntie, your uncle, and even your enemies. Yes, girl. Get your girl out there. I thank you guys so much. I appreciate you. I love you. And until the next time, peace. Uh -huh.